My BFI player choice this week is a Welsh language folk horror offering from director Lee Haven Jones, making his fiction feature debut. Written and produced by Roger Williams, it's a gruesome culinary allegory for those with an open mind and a strong stomach that proved a hit at South by Southwest in 2021. The feast will live. Carry, did him that? Did him that? I don't want to swill. I was caught in best of them swilling and arach and arachty. Are you canny? Quit. Get a human away, baby. Can I need one? Come on. Can I need that? Can I? When an arrogant MP and his landed gentry wife host a dinner party, local girl Caddy, charismatically played by Annis Elwi, is hired to help. What the guests don't realise is that this isn't so much a three-course banquet as a last supper. Gradually, it becomes clear that there's more to Caddy, who says little but has an ear for a folk tune, than meets the eye. When plans to bespoil a site of folkloric significance are revealed, it seems that everyone here is simply digging their own grave. In the tradition of bourgeois satires like Marco Ferreri's La Grande Bouffe, or more recently The Menu, the feast uses its fine dining setup to take satirical swipes at the gluttonous greed of its subjects. Those in search of outre splatter and bizarre screen extremities will find plenty to sink their teeth into, because the bill of fare boasts a bloody smorgasbord of gruesome violence with added vagina dentata bite. Writing in Sight and Sound magazine, my colleague Anton Bittel astutely described the movie as serving up a feast for the eyes while accommodating more than one interpretation. For this is all at once environmental fable, Bittel wrote, anti-colonialist allegory, and Hanekean portrait of a family undone by its own errant appetites and all-consuming greed. I think that pretty much nails it.